Hi everybody, let's paint the white t-shirt and my first advice in this kind of uh, painting is never use pure white or white in your white t-shirt. <laughs> it's something that sounds weird, but it's the best way to achieve a great white looking uh, fabric. In my case, I have mixed the clear skin color with black and a bit of blue to generate a dark bluish tone that I uh, used to paint all the dark parts of the of the first prime I have applied in the figure. And now, as you see, I have had a bit of off-white uh, to paint the blocks of color that are uh, most exposed to more exposed to the light, right? So as you see, I'm taking advantage of the white prime that we have applied uh, at the beginning to cover easily uh, with uh, this light gray that I'm applying right now. After doing that, because we only have two blocks of color, I need to apply a third one. So this one is going to be a slightly less luminous gray that I'm using to uh, build a bridge between the two blocks and also to make the shirt looks more white than it, it does. Okay, because I have filled too much uh, extension of, of the t-shirt with dark rays. So I'm trying to uh, make it look looks more luminous. At the same time, this medium light tone uh, is going to generate some gradient in the previous uh, blocks. Now I'm using uh, off-white plus a bit of yellow to uh, paint the highlights on the on the t-shirt. I'm using this tone with a bit of uh, yellow because it's the opposite color, the complementary color of the blue. And remember that we have used blue in the shadows of our t-shirt, so we are achieving a great contrast because of the complementary game of colors of yellow and blue. And now with a dark gray, dark gray is blue, uh, I'm painting some cast shadows under the arm, as you see, it looks pretty good. It's op optional, uh, absolutely optional, but I think it looks great. And I'm painting under more here. The trick to uh, paint these casted shadows is that you never use pure black, please. Use dark grays, for example. And uh, you can paint some comic style shadows in the darker areas with the dark gray as well or blend them, it's up to you. In my opinion, it looks great in this kind of figures. And you can see right now uh, the white t-shirt where we didn't use white in any area. Oh, white is the most luminous color that we have used. So I hope you have enjoyed this white t-shirt with no white and I hope you paint your yours very soon. See you in the next video. Bye bye.